the study is the multi-center uh, randomized uh, placebo control or uh, RCT trial and uh, uh, we perform uh, this in 336 transfusion dependent thalassemia patient from 65 sites from 17 countries around the world and you know a country including Italy, Greece, US, UK, uh, go to the Middle East such as the Lebanon and to the Far East such as Thailand, Malaysia. So this is uh, one of the biggest uh, thalassemia studies so far. Uh, uh, the primary uh, outcome of this uh, trial uh, in this belief study is just to see whether with the use of Luspartacep, which is the subcutaneous injection, uh, will help to reduce uh, over 33% of the transfusion requirement in this particular patient group. Comparing uh, between the 12 weeks of the run-in period that we use as a control in order to measure the number of the transfusion that the patient requires. And that's the primary outcome that you know we see the clinical response of transfusion reduction over 33% at the week 13 to week 24. And the secondary objective is just to look at the transfusion reduction can go even a bit further to over 50% uh, uh, you know, at the same period of evaluation. And the study has reached both, you know, a major uh, primary outcome. And uh, in the presentation that I'm doing uh, uh, for this year, ASH, it's just a further evaluate, you know, those who respond quite well to the uh, molecule to see whether, you know, this response is sustainable beyond 24 weeks. And the result that we are showing that it seems to be the case because we can see, you know, those who respond quite well, they continue to respond even after 24 weeks. And we see the response up to 54 weeks based on, you know, our uh, evaluation based uh, latest data lock in September.